Hello! So, today I'm going to give you one of mine and Helen's favourite um, healthy recipes. It's a potato and veggie bake. So, um, it's originally a Mediterranean style bake, but um, I'm going to throw a little bit extra in. And you can use whatever veggies you like. I like to use peppers and onions, definitely. Um, today I've got some chopped up spinach and some courgette. I've done it before with broccoli and green beans as well. That's really nice. So um, I've already prepped everything. So can you see? So I've got courgette chopped up. I've got yellow pepper, red onion, and spinach all chopped up. So it's all ready to go. Um, the first thing what you need to do is I've got a bag of baby potatoes. I'm gonna get them in the pan. And then get them boiling. So part boil, so you don't have to be fully boiled. There we go. Lots of nice hot boiling water. So that is all done. I'm going to part boil them. So they're done. So now what I'm going to do is get my big bowl and I'm going to start a nice seasoned up mix. So I have got a big mixing bowl right here. I'm going to get all my veggies into the bowl. So, this is a really nice recipe um, that you can prep in the day, leave it, and then roast it later on. So, I've got all my veggies in, the, in there. I'm going to give it a little mix up. Can you see? All nice, loads of good colours. Really good mix. Now, I only really cook with fry light, so, but if you like to use oil, you can. I'm only going to use a few sprays because you don't need a lot. Okay, just a few sprays in there. Give that another mix up. That's it. Okay, now um, I've got loads of seasoning. Um, I'm going to use today a lazy garlic. I really like this. It's called barbecue dry seasoning. And then I've got garlic and pepper because I like a little bit of spice I'm going to add in a few dried chilies and then the rest is just basically salt and pepper and um, you can use whatever dry seasoning you like so I've got a full cupboard of it I absolutely love all my seasoning so whatever flavors you like to work with but because it's Mediterranean style I'm going more with them sort of flavors so what I'm going to do I'm going to put a nice big healthy spoon of my lazy garlic so nice big spoon get that in there actually i'm going to do a bit more good for our bloods okay a few chilies just a little bit because helen doesn't really like a lot of spice but i do okay here's my barbecue i'm going to be heavy on the barbecue oh i need to buy more okay and then my garlic and the pepper yeah not measured not measured just bong it in as much flavor as you like basic seasoning pepper salt not too much salt just a little bit and then i'm just going to mix that up make sure it's all fully coated okay so can you see lots and lots of seasoning and then give it a really good mix we want all them seasoning con co coated all the veggies Oh, it smells amazing. So that's have a really good mix. Okay. Can you see? All mixed up. Mmm. Okay, and then my favourite thing to cook with, chopped tomatoes. Yeah? Tin, full tin of chopped tomatoes in we bash. In, 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 in. Wash it, recycle it, and then another mix. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like summer in a bowl. <laughs> this is a really nice, um, if you're having a barbecue as well. So it goes really nice with barbecue food. Okay, so that is all mixed up. 
and I'm gonna just leave that now on the side until the potatoes are done. Can you see? Oh, it smells so good. Now, it's just a little bit more ingredients. The pure de resistance. Balsamic vinegar. Vinegar. Balsamic vinegar. It's such a hard word for me to say. Be generous, guys. Give it a good splodge. Okay, that'll do. And then what you do is mix it up again. That smells incredible. Okay, then leaving that there to soak up all them flavours. Get rid of all my seasonings. I'm going to leave the balsamic out because when it is baking later in the oven, so you'll put it in the oven for about 20 minutes, get it out, give it a good stir, put a little bit more balsamic on and a little bit of dry basil. Dry basil goes amazing on it, but only put the basil and the second lot of balsamic vinegar on towards the end of the cooking. In total, when it's cooking, it's about 40 minutes, yeah? You can leave it longer if you want to. And then when the potatoes are finished, I'm gonna drain them and put them in there, okay? So, my potatoes are boiled, not fully boiled, just part boiled, about 10, 15 minutes. So now I'm going to drain them off. Oh, I've lost one. Get in there. Right, little wiggles. Right, they're all drained. So now, put it to our lovely season mixed. Add it all together. Okay, so... Give it a good mix. We want all them seasonings and all them yummy flavours covered in your potatoes. Okay. Oh, it looks good. I really have to wait till tonight to eat this because it looks delish. Okay. So, all covered nice. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Now guys, what I'm going to do, get me fry light again. I have got roasting dish. Again, just a little bit so that your seasoning doesn't stick. That's it. And then lob it in there. Okay, now you need to try and get it even. Otherwise, we end up with all the seasoning on one side. Okay, that's it. Get all that garlic, all them yummy flavours in and on top. So, this looks good, if I don't say so myself. <laughs> okay, so, this now can be left. How good does that look? <laughs> Okay, so your cooking instructions are about 200 in the oven, roast it 20 minutes, get it out, give it a stir, yeah, um, put it back in the oven and then five minutes before you're about to get it out the oven, put a little bit more balsamic on and a little bit of basil. So um, I'm just going to use dried seasoning basil, sprinkle that over the top another five minutes in the oven get it out now when you get it out it's going to be so hot so just leave it on the side while you're getting your plates and your knives and forks and everything ready so that's it guys that's my potato veggie bake and it looks so good enjoy let me know if you make it send me pictures send me videos if you enjoy it and um, let me know if you try anything different any different flavors any different veggies so that is literally your five a day, plus, plus, plus. So loads of really good stuff. And you've got your protein from your spinach and you've got all your good um, vitamins and minerals from all your different veggies. So please enjoy it. Let me know if it was worth me while doing it and if you enjoy it. Okay, guys, 